So while our percussionists get set up for this next piece, I just wanted to say a quick hello um, and thank you all for coming out tonight. It's fantastic to see a full house um, every single year. This place gets fuller and fuller, um, which is awesome to see. Um, it's great to see so much support from not only the parents, but community members um, coming out to support our music program um, here at the high school. Um, the next piece actually has a little bit of an interesting story. Um, it's by a fairly local composer, um, Andy Boysen Jr., who is director of bands over at UNH, uh, not too very far from here. Um, he wrote this piece of music, and actually we did a piece of music last year um, called Tricycle, which is very similar to this piece. Um, and this piece, he decided that he asked himself, what if? What if I took a piece of music that I had already written um, and I decided to start over but using the same general idea that I started with. And this piece of music um, rose out of that idea, um, and it became a very different piece of music. Um, and I think the band actually agrees with me that this is probably a better piece of music um, than the other one that we played um, last year. Um, so without further ado, this is Time Streams by Andy Boysen Jr.
You guys can sit. Holy cow, that's a uh, challenging piece, so congratulations to them on a great, great performance of that. That was fantastic. Um, I just want to take a moment. Um, we also had um, a member of the band um, accepted into Allstate today um, on clarinet, Miss Jenna Bodwin. So a big, big congratulations to her. Um, I'd also like to take a moment to thank the um, Sanford Music Boosters. Um, they came in this afternoon, did all this wonderful decorating that you see. Um, they put up the lights. Um, they're providing refreshments and cookies. Sorry, I'm a little out of breath. Um, they're providing uh, cookies and refreshments, um, and they help support everything that we do here. Uh, what we do here would not be possible without the hard work of our Music Boosters. Um, so a big round of applause for them. Thank you. Um, this next piece actually features um, a little piano solo. Um, we actually have a member uh, who is not a part of the band, but this young man was working with the chorus this semester. Um, and I asked him to play this little piano solo with us. Um, so please welcome to the stage uh, Mr. Silas Noble. <laughs>
That last piece actually has a little bit of an interesting story too. Um, it was written by um, famous choral composer Eric Whitaker, and he was approached by DreamWorks to actually write a soundtrack for a movie that was coming out. Um, and he wrote the piece of music, and he waited and waited and waited, and he was waiting to hear back from DreamWorks and DreamWorks and nothing and nothing. So we called them, and they said, oh, sorry, we forgot to let you know, the movie was canceled. Uh, <laughs> so in its place, the movie was supposed to be about a seal um, based on the Rudyard Kipling story, um, but he wrote this little piece of music, and the movie actually eventually became Kung Fu Panda, which is a little bit interesting. <laughs> Uh, but uh, he kept the piece of music, and it became a very beautiful choral piece um, slash band piece. Um, our last piece that we're doing.